Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. No matter what time you're tuned into this video, we hope you're doing good or great or better than amazing. Either one is fine with us. This is day 13 of the VIP challenge. And of course, you got yours truly, Mr. And this is. Smith. You see, it is day 13, so you've had the ability to really tap into a ton of things pertaining to your credit, all of the steps, all of the modules, all of the things that we went over to really express the importance and the things that you could get accomplished pertaining to your credit. In addition, we also start taking you down a journey to let you know that, look, this is bigger than just your credit. If you want to be wealthy, if you want to have financial stability long term, you got to look at more than just your credit, which includes having overall personal financial success. So we got you a dose of what the personal financial success company has to offer. You already have access to the membership, my income, whether you knew it or not, you're here. And it's a good thing that you're here because we can help you get from where you are financially to wherever you want to be. So we told you to look at the overview and the full version of what we have to offer. We even went over what it takes in order to understand the W-4. So hopefully you've already taken that step to review the W-4. Today what we want to go over is the debt elimination tool. We've exposed it to you before, but repetition is the parent of learning. So that being said, we want to expose it to you again, but also give you some new perspective that we feel can really take your finances and wealth to the next level. So without further ado, this page should look very familiar. This is the, the BMC, Business Management Center the place that you'll find as soon as you log in and you're going to see all of these tabs but right now we're not going to focus on anything but the debt elimination tab shall we so let's talk about it all right here on the debt elimination tab you see the debt elimination calculator yes you guys so we are on day number what 13, 13. All right, so day number 13, you've had a lot of things done at this point. Hopefully, you know, you're waiting on responses from the credit bureaus, you know, from your disputes, as well as some of the other homework that we gave you, like adjusting your W-4. What we're going to talk about in this video is debt elimination, okay? Keep in mind, we keep saying it, you keep saying it, my econ is the personal financial success company so it's so much bigger than credit but guess what everything contributes to your credit right so everything is a contributing factor including your debt elimination you remember when we went over revolving debt and installment debt and the ratio that you should have and the utilization that you have guess what it all ties into your credit. So what we want to show you today is the My Econ Debt Elimination Tool. So you saw how he got there. There's a quick two and a half minute video. And look, what you got to understand is that debt is robbing us of our cash flow and is one of the biggest obstacles to obtaining financial success. All right. So we, you should be familiar with this. We gave you a little bit of a snapshot in the five-day challenge, but we are going to just take it a step further, okay? We're going to put some notes in here. If you notice, we have all of the creditors already listed. You got your Visa credit card. You got your timeshare. You got your car. You got your mortgage, okay? We list the balances old, the interest rate of all of those, as well as the minimum payment that you're paying monthly. Let's say you're able to free up just an extra $200 in cash flow. And keep in mind, we showed you ways to free up your cash flow, you guys. Some of you can get this $200 from adjusting your W-4. Some of you can get $200 by just cutting back on your expenses, okay? So there's a lot of different ways that you can generate additional cash flow, all right? So we're just going to do this quick example. Look. For a person that is maybe living check to check or not financially educated, a lot of the times they seem or they feel a little bit defeated. They don't know how they're going to become debt free. But look, once we click save and calculate on just $200 in additional cash flow, it actually brings up a game plan for you, okay? So look at this. It shows that with just $200 in additional cash flow, what we're going to do is that snowball effect that we told you about before, okay? That $200 was put on top of your $50 minimum payment on your Visa card, and guess what? In 14 months, you can have that terminated. Your timeshare, 
okay, in 28 months, you can have that terminated because on top of the minimum payment, you took the 250 from the credit card that is now paid off plus the $200 in additional cash flow, okay? Or, I'm sorry, that was all there. The $250 plus the 120 minimum payment, that gives you $370, and you could terminate a $5,000 timeshare in 28 months, okay? That's a little bit over two years. Same thing with your car, a $15,000 car that you were making a minimum payment of $300 on, imagine paying an extra $370, okay? In 42 months, your car is gone. Then we're going to knock out the big beast, all right? We're going to knock out that $200,000 mortgage in 129 months, you guys. Look at this. Look at what's listed in bold. The total debt to eliminate was $223,000. If you follow the debt elimination plan, this debt will be eliminated in 10 years and 9 months. you got to look at the bulk of that was the mortgage, okay? That's what's going to take the longest. But as far as your car, your timeshare, your visa, all of those things are being knocked out. You could be debt-free as it pertains to those things in under 4 years. I love it. And see, this is what you got to understand. You'll be completely debt-free by 2030. And have $2,100, $2,170 to be exact, in new monthly available cash flow. Yes. So now it's a matter of what you do with that new cash flow, whether you splurge some, invest some, flip some. Now you just have more cash flow, and this is what is an example of financial freedom. You see, financial freedom doesn't necessarily have to be being a millionaire, although it's okay to strive to make that happen or even better. But you definitely want to have some additional cash flow and you will feel like a millionaire because you have freedom. So understand the power in that. Now, let's just say, for example, you want to knock out this debt in less than 10 years and 9 months. Or let's say that your W-4 adjustment didn't get you $200. You already had it correct and, you know, you didn't get a dime back. This is an opportunity for you to take a cohort look at your scenario and say, how can I make this better? How can I hit my goals sooner? How can I enhance what I already have and make it better? It's all about striving and making progress and making things better. A perfect thing for you to do is to increase your cash flow. Let's say you've already minimized your expenses to the legal minimum. Let's say you've already adjusted your W-4 and you got this $200 right here that we're showing. Let's say you've done all of the things, sold all of the stuff, you know, that you had in your garage that was just collecting dust. Let's say you did all of those things. What now? Well... The best way to create a new ongoing form of cash flow is by creating some form of business income. So let's talk about business income just for a brief second. As it relates to business income, it's money that you make outside of your current form of income that you're earning. So if you're currently working a job, it's money that you make outside of that job. If you currently are self-employed some way, it's money that you make outside of that, in addition to what you're already making. So... Don't shy away from earning business income. If you've made it this far into the challenge, you've already went through the five-day credit challenge and you in the VIP challenge, then you've acquired a form of knowledge that a lot of people don't know about. Most people don't have a clue of all of the factors that go into bettering their credit. Most people don't have access to all of the tools and resources that you now have access to in the form of letters and documents and things that you can do in order to better your credit. Most people don't have a resource such as the My Econ Back Office and a tool like this in order to better not only their credit but their finances overall. So the question is, how many people do you know who would love to have better credit? How many people do you know that would love to have less debt? How many people do you know who would love to be on the road to financial success because they currently have no plan? Well, guess what? You expose that to them, and now you increase your cash flow because we'll pay you to share this information with others. We'll pay you on upfront on an upfront basis. You get paid weekly, but you can also position yourself to get monthly residual income because you shared this with somebody else. Let's say you wanted to invite others to the five-day credit challenge, and now they get exposed to the credit challenge, and they decide that they also want to be VIP as you've done. Yes. We make sure that you will get paid and accredited for those that you invited to the five-day credit challenge. 
all because you took matters in life into your own hands and decided to say, you know what, I'm not going to be stingy with this knowledge. Not only am I going to better my own finances, but as I'm bettering my own finances, I'm going to help someone else better their finances and credit. And because I help them better their finances and credit, I get paid, which allows me to help me better my finances and credit even more. So take a look at those scenarios and just ask yourself, are you open to sharing the good news of what you've been able to get exposed to? And now that puts more money into your pocket, and more money in your pocket means you hit your goals faster. So imagine you had an extra $1,000 going back in per month. Let's just say you made an extra, you know, I want to play with a number real quick. I just feel froggy for a second. Let's <laughs> say that you added an extra $300 into your, you know, your 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 cash flow. Extra 300 So it was that 200 So... Plus 300, we had 500. So that's why I got that number from. Let's say you added this extra $300 a month back into your monthly cash flow. What would that do to your goal? What would that do to your roadmap to where you were eliminating that debt in 10 years and 9 months? What just happened here? Now you knocked it down to 9 years and 2 months. Let's go ahead and crank that number up one last time. It could just be because that interest is so high when you're dealing with 21% and 20% interest. Keep in mind what we told you to look for when you're actually applying for different things. Absolutely. So let's say you had an extra $1,000 in cash flow. This is $800 plus the $200. But let's just say you had an extra $1,000 in cash flow because you decided, you know what, I'm going to share what it is that I'm learning. I'm going to expose people to this information. And now you got an extra $1,000 in cash flow coming in. How much would that help? Now you chop that down in seven years and four months. We're talking about paying off a whole mortgage, a yeah. car, timeshare. A visa, and you're knocking this down in less than the amount of time people usually uh, have a job, meaning that most people never pay off their mortgage. Yes. And now you're able to pay it off in a lot less time. So really strongly consider earning business income, an extra $1,000 a month from the comforts of your home. It does take work, but I promise you it's easier than not attempting. It's easier than settling for being in these long agreements to pay for the rest of your life. So I just wanted to paint that picture because we can help you do it and you're on the right track to making that happen. Yes, most definitely. Another thing you didn't add, babe, was people are in their mortgage typically for 30 years. Absolutely. And we're talking here about all of your debt, including your mortgage, being paid in seven years. So please keep this in mind, you guys. Um, as it pertains to helping other people, it's called Each One Teach one, all right? You get the knowledge, you reach back, you help somebody else, and we're making it extremely simple for you because all you got to do is add them to the five-day credit challenge group. Put them through the exact same process that you're going through, and guess what? By default, you're automatically going to help yourself. And I'm going to end with this quote, all right? The great Zig Ziglar yeah. said something to this tune, all right? It's not verbatim, but he said something to this tune. If you help enough people get what they want, automatically by default, you'll get what you want. And that's better credit and that's debt freedom. All right? That's all we got. Financial freedom at its best. Yes. Stay tuned for what's yet to come. We got a ton more down the pipeline, so thank you for rocking with us. That's all we got, Mr. And Mrs. Smith, signing, signing out. out.